Welcome to this video. Today I want to talk to you about the new updates here in iOS 16 for iPhone, which includes some very useful security and privacy features. Right now I'm here in settings, and if I scroll down just a little bit down to the privacy and security section and click on that, and then scroll down again just a little ways, right here you'll notice a new feature called safety check, and this is intended to allow a user a quick and easy way to cut someone off as far as access and just basically removing them out of your life. The use case for this would be if you're going through a divorce, a breakup, or just a domestic situation where you need to restrict someone's access and just cut them out. For the next feature, if I click on back and go all the way to the bottom down here, it will say lockdown mode. And this is a very useful feature that is brand new, which basically hardens your device and limits as much as possible points of attack. Users that should look at this option are those of you who are either celebrities or high-ranking officials in a business or organization, local or federal government officials, or even journalists, or anyone who may be targeted. This is something you should definitely look at. Now I can click on learn more and it's going to at first give just a rundown of what I just went over. And then if I continue down, it's going to point out what it specifically targets as far as restrictions such as messages, web browsing, FaceTime, Apple services, albums, USB accessories, and profiles, please note right here, it will point out that phone calls and plain text will still work as well as emergency features. So these things will still be usable. It's just limiting the points of attack or points of exploitation. Next, it's going to list how to turn it on. It's very simple. You just go back to where we just were and flip on the turn on switch. It will restart your iPhone and then you type in your passcode. And then below that, it will give you the option to add exclusions, but I would be very, 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 very careful with this because even a legitimate trusted website or application can be hijacked and exploited. And so I'd be very cautious. If you feel that you are going to be targeted, I would never add an exclusion. And then last, it's just going to have some information on profiles and how new profiles cannot be installed. The next feature I want to go over here is in the photo album and for a long time you could always come here to your pictures and click on the menu in the top right and select hide but this was kind of pointless because really all it was doing was just moving it to a different folder. However now when you hide a photo it will put it in the hidden folder but you'll notice now that it has a lock icon. These are now password protected as well as your recently deleted. This feature was long overdue. I'm very glad that they finally put it in but now you can actually hide and lock photos if you need to do so. I will post a link to this page down in the video description where you can see a full list of all the new features here in iOS 16 but specifically Again, here are the privacy and security features. And those three that we went over are very, very good. Please take advantage of them. But that's everything for this video. If you have any comments or questions, please post them down below. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and please consider sharing it. And if you'd like to support the channel, go ahead and hit that join button, the subscribe button, and that bell notification icon to get notifications on future videos. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you have a great day.